Welcome to the Wise Words series. There are so many things in this world that you only get them once. One of them is your father. Your father is a person that no man can replace him. You will only get him once and you will lose him once. And once he's gone, then you will realize what kind of a person he was. Today, we live in a day and age where we have forgotten our father. We have lost touch with him. We don't know when he comes from work, when he goes to work. What does he do for us? Is he healthy today? Is he feeling all right? Is he not feeling ill or something? Tell me, how many of us really care about him? How many of us wake up in the morning and see where is my dad? Or go even find him, go looking for him, say hello to him. All we do is get on with our own lives. We only need him or we only go to him when we need some money or anything else. Otherwise, who's dad? We don't know. Who's my dad? Who's my father? Who, on the weekends, do we chill out with him or do we chill out with our friends? You don't get to see him. Even though he might be expecting to see you in the evening, sitting down with him on the table, having food, lunch or dinner together. When he tells us to do something, we're like, we don't want to do it. Who are you to tell me this? We give him answers. We tell him off. We say things to him that you don't want to be said to yourself. But we do all of that. You have completely, today, today we have completely lost touch with our parents, especially father completely lost touch. By Him, He does everything for us. He looks out for everything that makes us happy, puts food on the table, gives us clothes, shelter, house. But what do we do to Him? He doesn't need anything from us. He might not ask, but He has feelings. He doesn't show His love. His love is there, but we don't see His love. It's hidden. We can see everyone loving you, your friends, your family, other, other people. But he is a, he's a person who does not show love directly. But we neglect all of that. We overlook all of that. But, and we don't appreciate him. He is a person, who, if something goes wrong in your life, he'll be there right number one on your side. He'll be the most happiest person for you when you, he sees you succeeding in life. When you get your results, when you pass your exams, he's the first person who is happy that, oh, my son or my daughter is going ahead in life. But what do we do for him? We have completely neglected him. We have, we have forgotten that special person from our life. And when he gets old, we don't even have one room in our big houses to provide him shelter. Rather, what we do is, Dad, now you have gone old, this is not your place. You need to go to the old age home, where the old people live, where you belong. You don't belong here. But he's the one who has kept you all right from your birth to whatever age you decided to go. In his house, fed you, provided you everything. But on the other hand, when he needs us, when he's gone old, we're not there for him. Rather, he's sitting down in, in some care home, remembering the good memories. But I'll tell you one day, one day we'll all remember him when we look around in the house and he's not there. That's when you realize that you have really missed somebody 
from your life. He's gone. And he's not going to come back. And if he was happy with you, then you are blessed. And if he left from this world and you were not happy with him and he wasn't happy with you, then your life is a disaster and you can never fix that again. So this is your chance. Go to him. If you see him today, go to him. Give him a hug. Kiss him on his forehead and tell your dad, I love you before it's too late.